Hello friends, we are back and in previous videos we have learned many things how to edit your page, how to put your logo, how to put your text logo, how to add your favicon in top of your website and how to edit whole. That is a free theme which we are using for making our website. So what we need to do, we need to add more pages here because sample page is not only a page we will use it. First we will do that, first we will decide what we are going to make. So we are going to make our portfolio website. So what we will do, we have our introduction part, the basic introduction part in front of the index page. But we need to make, the more pages will be identify our more information, what we are and what about the website is okay so we are going to add today a portfolio page so you need to go to my portfolio then dashboard click on dashboard and you will get a dashboard theme in front of you because uh, when you are going to the dashboard there are many options are available what you need to do and how you do that let's learn today so for making a new page, first we will go to the pages. You can see here in pages, first we need to go and then we will see all pages. We will click on all pages, then we will redirect to the all pages. You remember the sample page? You not know, So I am going to show you what is the sample page. That is your sample page which you can see in your website. So I am opening your website again. So when you click on sample page, what do you see? When I am clicking on sample page, I will see my image here and all the stuff which is by default written here. Okay, so I don't want that. So I will go back my pages then all pages then I will click on trash and delete this page because I don't want this page I am clicking on trash and that is working for removing this page so the sample page has been removed here so you can see sample page is no longer present here so what we need to do, we need to add a page. So we will go to the pages, then all pages, then we will click on add new. So when we click on add new, a new page will come. So how the page will look? Let's see. So add new page. So we will put here the name of our page, what we want to make. I want to make here a page which is a portfolio page so I will type here portfolio and I will come here and you can see here page attributes so I will change the page attribute and click on showcase why I click on showcase I will tell you after some time you click on publish And now you can see your page has been published and uh, if I refresh this page, portfolio is here and uh, when I click on portfolio, 404 not found, okay. So page is added manually, very good. So what we need to do for adding portfolio, we, we need to go to the portfolio then add new we will click on add new so click we are going to create a portfolio page portfolio means what you have worked if i am a software developer i have worked in many projects so i will keep here my one project so i will give here heading what is my project android project android 
project okay add new portfolio android project okay so i will click here on add new category click on add new category give a category my projects why we are giving here a category because we need to give a category for define what we are going to show we are showing here my projects so my projects has been done and uh, give here below and click on set feature image when you click on set feature image you will see your images here and you go on upload files then select files click here on select files then choose your android project image so i am choosing my android project image that is here screenshot and uh, after selecting that i will click on set feature image okay you only follow my procedure and you will see what's going on on your portfolio page you can keep here my android project okay bold and click on publish so that has been updated published i will go on my portfolio page refresh it and then i will click on portfolio so you can see here my portfolio page you are watching here my projects that was your project okay and uh, you are looking here android project when you are clicking here one animation is coming why this is coming because we click on showcase i tell you remember change default to showcase when you are making your portfolio page so that is the reason that is coming like that okay so we will make two three more portfolio so click on add new and do the same thing and you have adjust your portfolio category my project so always keep your project inside the my project okay so click here and write here my blog and write here my blog and make it bold click here on portfolio category click on set feature image go on upload files then go on select files then you select here your image simple simple things no need to do more difficult things set feature image and after coming this image you need to only publish you need to only publish and after publishing that that option come update that mean your post has been published so go to the portfolio and refresh the page you can see here android project and my blog they both are here as a showcase and if you want you can add more i'm not adding more so i will go back to my previous page sample page okay so for today that is sufficient we have deleted the sample page if you want to keep the sample page you can keep and if you want to delete you can delete so that is depend on you and for today that's all we have learned today how to make your own
portfolio page and how to show your all the details here so click on portfolio and you can see here all the details are here available okay so that's all thank you and uh, go to my channel and please subscribe in only in 20 days we have reached 48 subscriber the new year is coming so happy new year to you all because maybe you are watching after a long time this video and that is a belated happy new year for you but happy new year you all friends be happy in your life and don't forget to subscribe comment and like that's all thank you